Hello Aquarius and welcome to your general reading for May 2020. We're going to be using two beautiful decks of cards for you today. We're going to use the Major Arcana in the Gildy Tarot and we're going to use the Oracle of the Angels. I'm super excited to do this reading for you today. So thank you for being here and if you are new to the channel, welcome. Subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. And I am doing a singles reading and a twin flame reading as well so you can check those out. But this is your reading and what's going on with you. So thank you angels what do we need to know for Aquarius please for May 2020 what do we need to know for Aquarius during this amazing month of May let's see what's going on thank you angels wow did you see that jump out then super fast super powerful okay so I'm going to do an anchor spread for you to see what the big things going on are and then we're going to bring in the angel card so the first thing we've got coming up is illusion and I love this because this card's sticking out here and it's positive intention. So the angels are asking you to remain positive about your life in May because there may be some fear around, some illusion. And the angels are wanting to set you free. And the way you set yourself free is by freeing your mind, by trusting in who you are, by believing in yourself, by setting positive intentions. And when you think about what you want, you can truly start to bring it about into your life. And, you know, you're feeling calmer right now. You know, you're feeling stronger. You're feeling free. And the angel is saying it's the perfect time to bring blessings into your life. So think about what you want and desire and start to allow it to flow in. Because you're the magician. I love this. So this is showing you that you're setting intentions. You're thinking about what you want. You're feeling stronger. And you're releasing this fear. You know, you're letting go, you're being purified right now, you're being cleansed. So this is the perfect time for you to go within and start manifesting great change, creating beautiful things and asking the universe for what you desire. So great times ahead for you, Aquarius. And this is showing you patience is the key. So remember when you're creating and when you're manifesting and setting those magical intentions that you have to give them time to manifest. So you can't get impatient on this journey. You have to trust and keep the faith. You have to have unwavering faith that what you're asking for is coming, no matter what it is, whether it be wealth, health, happiness, or even love. So whatever you're asking the universe for, trust that it's coming with unwavering faith and positive intention, and then it will start to flow in because you're going through a completion phase right now. You know, there's great magic coming into your life and beautiful things ahead. And wow, look at that. We've got believe. And this is powerful, you know, because you've got here this card showing you that the angels are asking you to set intentions, to be very positive in what you want it. You know, believe that you can achieve it. So you ask for what you want with positive intention by manifesting, by creating it. And then you believe with unwavering faith that it's yours and it's on the way. And this is powerful because, you know, you're on a journey right now and you create the powerful journey that you're on. In other words, it can either be good or bad, high or low, you decide. Are you thinking positively right now? Or are you thinking negatively? Because you can change your thoughts because you're the creator. So start changing the way you're feeling. Start thinking more positive. Start expecting the best. Start talking to heaven about what you desire and then allow the universe to give it to you. So I feel you're going to be doing some deep thinking as well during this month of May because, you know, you've got all of this stuff going on in your mind. You know, you've got lots going on up there. There could be some confusion and the angels are asking you to move into karma waters by believing and trusting that heaven is in your hands. You know, that you create your reality, that you are in charge of your life, especially in love. So if you're wanting love, you know, if you're a twin flame or even if you're single and you're wanting love right now, the power is in your hands. You have to let go. You have to believe. So trust in the power of love. Trust in the passion that it's all falling into place. And there's so much to be grateful for. 
you know, there's beautiful happiness coming into your life and the person of your dreams, you know, what you're intending. If you want your person to really work for you right now, which means you want someone stable in your life, you want someone who can look after you, you know, you don't want someone wishy-washy with their emotion, it's all flowing in because I feel in your future, you know, happiness and stability with a partner that can truly be there for you once you let go of illusion and you release the fear. So the angels are asking you to trust and we've got wow moving towards the light. And this is like you're on a journey right now. You know, you're on the path to PC, you're finding your way. And if you're a twin flame, you're finding your way to union. And this is you and your divine masculine moving towards the light, moving over the bridge. This is your masculine becoming the emperor for you, you know, becoming stronger. The more you believe, the quicker you'll receive. So this is showing you, Aquarius, you have to be strong. You have to remember who you are, that you are a being of light. And right now you're moving towards the light. You're releasing illusion. You're releasing fear. And you're trusting in who you are. And you're taking some time in May to think about what you want. To set these positive intentions. Because you're going on an adventure. And there's also a lot of healing going on. You know, they give me throat chakra activation and healing there. You know, maybe you're thinking about your words before you say them. So you're monitoring your thoughts, you're thinking about the self-talk, things you're thinking to bring in this positive intention. So you're only bringing about what you're thinking about with good intention. You're manifesting and creating what you desire and you're starting to believe, to believe that you can have what you want, to believe that this journey is yours, that you're manifesting right now, that you know you will be in union with your twin flame, that everything will flow in. But you have to have patience and strength and understanding and understand that you're going through this change right now and you're raising your vibration and you're seeing the truth. And the truth is not illusion. You know, illusion is fear and fear is a false experience appearing real. So you have to rise above this and to remain solid in your mind and trust in who you are and have this amazing attitude of gratitude that will move you towards the light and it will bring all of your blessings in, including great love. So during this month of May, set your intentions, feel good, believe and then everything you want will start flowing in and you'll be moving towards the light moving further and farther on your journey and you'll feel better i hope this helps sending you so much love have a great month and i'll see you soon